Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Eho2J here with another video. Thank you for so much for tuning into this video. I hope you guys are doing well and you had a wonderful week. If you didn't, I hope you have a better week and a more productive week. So we're just gonna hop right into this video and you can probably tell by the title today we're gonna be talking about some wardrobe basics. I honestly did not count, so I don't know. Some wardrobe basics that I think every girl or woman and I think these are so basic they could even apply to men too should I have in their closet if you're trying to build more of a capsule wardrobe if you're trying to improve on your style and you don't really know where to begin I think this is a great foundational point that you can build from here and you can make numerous 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 outfits from these pieces that I'm going to show you today all right so let's hop right into it so the first item that we're going to Look at today is this black leather jacket. I feel like a black leather jacket is such a staple. I feel like everyone should have one. I feel like everybody should have everything that I'm gonna mention in today's video. So I got this from Boohoo about a year ago. I'm pretty sure they probably still have this on the website. If they don't, you can find it on so many different other websites and um, clothing brands, fast fashion brands. You can either, you know, go really high end with a leather jacket because it's such a staple or you can just stay in like that affordable range, which I did. The next thing that we're going to look at is a black turtleneck. Guys, when I tell you that I probably have a slight obsession with turtlenecks, um, they're like one of my favorite winter clothing pieces. I this one from ASOS um, actually a few months ago because I needed to replace the one that I had for a couple years which um, I used it from year to year to year it basically grew with me it's really great quality the sleeves are long they're not short just in case you are 5'7 and above I am 5'7 and they stop about here on me so pretty long pretty decent so I really really love turtlenecks <laughs> I feel like I can't express that enough. And again with the turtleneck. So this one is a cream turtleneck from H&M. Turtleneck is not a must like the black one is, but it really does come in handy when you really just want to change up your style and not feel like you're wearing black all the time, which sometimes I can find that a problem. So I've been trying to implement more neutrals and creams into my wardrobe. Next thing on the list would be a cream or white t-shirt. In the summertime, I would probably go for more of a white, stark white, but and I got this from TJ Maxx. Um, guys, if you are building your wardrobe and you wanna start somewhere and either you just don't have a lot of money to be spending $20 on one t-shirt, or you're just like, it's a basic, I'm gonna keep on replacing it, it's gonna get you know adjusted every now and then. I want different types of white t-shirts or cream t-shirts, not just one that I wear all the time and it gets ruined really fast. Going to your department stores are, is a great option if you want to like get like basics, like leggings, you know, I really do love it. It's not too short and it's not cropped, so I, I really appreciate the quality of the shirt. So having a white basic t-shirt is along again with shirts. I think that having a white button down shirt is very essential to a growing closet. This one is a satin material from Misguided. It's a little bit oversized. I'm not so much of a fan of oversized clothes, but this one is really good because you can wear, layer it. Definitely having a white button down is a staple in male, female, anybody's closet. I, I think it's very essential. You should definitely invest in a nice black shirt that you like. Um, for girls, of course, you can, girls and boys, you can buy more than one black shirt. You can have more than one black t-shirt, but this is one that kind of has like restoration on it. It has like restored. Not restoration. It has like sparkles on it, so if you want to bling it up a little bit more, you can wear it. This is more like a long black shirt, I like a t-shirt, actual t-shirt, and this one is more cropped. And like I said, I had a black version of the cream when I showed you. So that is, if you want to change it out, if you wear high waisted pants and you want something more cropped, this is the way to go. If you're trying to wear like a, a longer t-shirt on some pants and like the leather jacket, you know, that this is another way to go. So having a black t-shirt in your closet is very essential to help building more outfits. I think that another closet essential would be a black blazer. I have a lot of blazers, but it is one of my favorite clothing <laughs> items. I say that I feel like about everything. Um, next to turtlenecks, blazers are you my, my favorite because you can wear them in any season. You can dress it up, make it look really corporate, really professional, or dress it down with some jeans and some sneakers. Um, ASOS 
can probably see on the tag. This is a US size 8. It, it, it fits me really nice. It's not oversized. It's really fitted. I wanted that. Like I, So yeah, so black blazer is very, very important and I think everyone should have it. So next item would be a camel or stone colored blazer. So you just, you can get the idea that having, you know, a quality stone blazer is very essential to your wardrobe and just can elevate your look and just make you look more put together and chic and elegant. So yeah, invest, definitely invest in a camel blazer. I got this, like I just said, I think I said that from ASOS. So yes, it is really, really good blazer. <laughs> so the next item is, would be this trench coat. This is like, guys, I love this trench coat so much. For like at least a year, I've been searching for like the perfect trench coat for me. Um, the one that was long enough, one that was the right color. Some friends and family of mine who like this one in particular. So hopefully ASOS brought it back. If they haven't, I will continue to search for you guys. <laughs> So the next item on the list would be a pair of black trousers or black pants. Uh, this one is also from ASOS and it's also a recent purchase because I was I just needed a black pant. I had black jeans and I didn't really have black pants. I had leggings and jeans and so much leggings and jeans. <laughs> but I was just like, I needed black pants for like interviews. If you just ever just want to make your outfit just look more chic and not wear jeans i'm not saying that jeans aren't chic but if you just really just want to step it up just a little bit and you're not in the mood for jeans then this is a great option i think everyone should have a pair of black pants because you know that spontaneous opportunity that door open you know that that door opening that god provided for you that you weren't expecting and you need to run to an interview you don't want to be shopping for black pants you got to prepare yourself now <laughs> and great quality and they are skinny they are like uh, they're not cigarette they're just skinny black pants so the next item will be a pair of blue jeans this pair is from azos again this is one of my favorite jeans ever like it is so quality it fits me so well and makes my butt look so good like so good like it's a miracle <laughs> But yes, this this is really fitting. It has like the flare ends, which I don't really, I didn't really, I don't really like that flare end style. But it just makes up for it in the overall just cut and feel of the jeans. It's just a blue skinny jean. Um, I think a blue skinny jean. If you want to buy any jean, start with the blue skinny jean. We probably already all have a blue skinny jean in our closet. Even the jeans I have now, they're basically like, you don't see us? You don't see us? Because I literally don't wear any other ones. <laughs> I, this is my favorite one and it goes with literally everything. So I wear it all the time and maybe I should show my other jeans some love, but these are my favorite pair of jeans. So. so the next item guys would be a mom jean or just a different style of jean. Why I brought this into like the basic wardrobes is because you want to have just a little bit more fun and creativity and just change it up every once in a while and not look like you just wear the same pair all, all the time. But it's good to change it up and it doesn't have to be a mom jean because I really want style of jeans other than skinny. I feel like it's very important to just have something other than a skinny jean. I got these from Misguided. Misguided has quite a few um, different types of mom jeans and this was called like the Blue Riot mom jeans and they're really good. I really like them. So another closet basic that I think you should have would be a black dress. This is, you know, a black dress. This is one of the black dresses I have right now. I have a long one and I'm trying to get more like a more bodycon fitted black dress to go under, you know, big coats and stuff. But a black dress is very essential. and. I added this in here like kind of at the last minute because I felt that I was thinking of different outfits like putting together outfits in my head and getting inspiration and I was just like I do not have enough black dresses but this is the one I do have it is a padded sleeve dress this is also from ASOS but definitely invest in a black dress little black dress satin t-shirt material jersey material is definitely good to have one in your closet hop into like the shoes now so I believe that having a just a white pair of sneakers or a white pair of shoes is very beneficial to a nice capsule wardrobe. 
I feel like just white sneakers go with everything. If you're a sneakerhead, of course, you will have more than just a white sneaker. But if you're just starting out and you just like want a sneaker that can really go with a lot of things, I definitely encourage you to pick up a white sneaker. These are Pumas. I got this from a shoe department store, if that's what... Yeah, I got this from a DSW if you don't have that in your state or in your town. You can also just order from online or just look around and hunt for white sneakers that you like. I was a Converse girl for a very long time and I got tired of buying them every single year or every couple of months. Actually, not every year, every couple of months because I got tired of cleaning and cleaning and cleaning and cleaning. So the material of these are a lot easier to clean. There's so many white sneakers out there. You're bougie. You know, they got the Vera Wang, not the Vera Wangs, the Jimmy Cho ones. Uh, they got the Louis Vuitton ones. Um, these are Puma. <laughs> so, you know, there's just different, different types. They have the Adidas versions and all that. So this is definitely a good, a good basic to have in your wardrobe. And you can wear this at every, any season, any season you can have white sneakers, summer, fall, they don't. They don't go out of style and they don't go out of season. You can wear them every season. So get you one that you really like and you really enjoy. And I think the last closet essential, closet wardrobe basics, whichever one you want to say, is a pair of ankle boots. These are mine. I really love these boots. They are pointed, kind of pointed at the tip, pointed at the tip. And they just fit really well and they go with so many things, just like I've said with all these other pieces, they can be combined into so many different outfits and you can just play around with different things that you will have. All these things give me at least like 20 plus outfits to wear that you won't even be able to exhaust the amount of outfits that you have and going places with them. And of course, over time you add more, you build more, you have more stuff to wear. But definitely starting out, this is a good shoe to get. Well guys, that is all for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and you guys were able to grab a little bit of inspiration on some fall basics that I think everyone should have. I hope you guys have a wonderful week. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe and share. And I hope to see you guys in my next video. Bye.